All right, you dusty old lady. It's time for you to answer some for something. Oh my god, is she dead? See you on the other side. Oh, he straight up murdered her. Um, well, she's taking a permanent nap. It's not her blood. Here, let me help you. I will be fine, thank you. Where's Andrew? Andrew, where is he? He has taken Eddie. I, I tried to stop him, but he struck me. Me? There was a madness in his eye. I do not understand what is happening. First Eddie, and now Andrew. Edward. Open your eyes. See your husband for what he really was. A pawn of evil. An evil that infected and corrupted every life around him. How dare you speak about my Edward like that? Oh my freaking all god, the lady. He protected all his life. He was a man like no other. That he was, though not in the way you think. I will not hear another word from you about my husband. We don't have time for this. Look in the desk in the old wing if you will not believe us. She turned uh, up her chin at me. She might know more. We need to talk to her again. Without attacking her. Oh, of course. You're right. Her husband was a douchebag, man. I don't care what she says. Uh, this isn't him. No. My Edward couldn't have written this. Was he kind to her at all? He must have been. Okay. How do you feel about your darling husband now? David, Ooh. that's not helping. My Edward wouldn't. He couldn't have written this. It must have been Andrew. Or, or young Eddie. Yes, yes, that's who it was. Not Edward. Not my Edward. She's like brainwashed. What the hell? Is there anything you know about your husband? Something that could help us save Eddie's life? I don't know what it is, but I do know that Edward considered it valuable. What is it? Is it the last piece of the key? Oh my god, is the old lady about to duel her? I did what had to be done for our family. What else could I have done? Oh, oh shit! Ah! It is a duel of the old people! Oh my god! They're both dead. Oh. <laughs> I thought there was gonna be a winner. Oh my god. <laughs> it was so random and instantaneous. There was no buildup or nothing. She just shows up and they have a duel on the plank and they just both go overboard. <laughs> what the hell? So wait, if the old lady wasn't in on the plot, why did the butler attack me? Maybe he just didn't like my ass. He just lost his mind. He served me one too many breakfasts and just pissed him off. I still can't believe that she died. Oh my god, everybody is dead except for Andrew. I'm literally, like, if I'm not the owner of this house at the end of this, then I don't even know. <laughs> the freaking maid died, the butler died, the gardener died, the freaking old ladies died. It's just me. And my weird looking out the side of my head ass. I haven't been to bed in like a hot minute. <laughs> Do I ever sleep? <laughs> Batman never sleeps. Sleep is for the weak. Alright, now that I have the key, I should be able to unlock this. There we go, I think that's right. Alright, for fuck's sake. Thank you. Stop your whining! You are seeing something again, aren't you? Yes. Give her back! Yeah, yeah, you killed her! It's your fault! Oh my god. So that's why he buried it in Cecilia's grave. Oh, he killed him. What did you see, David? My father. Uh, and Edward, he... It's all right. Take your time. He killed him. Well, murder mystery solved. <laughs> we know who murdered everyone else, and then we know who murdered the murderer. <laughs> Margaret covered up the fact that Edward didn't die by accident. He was murdered. Murdered? By whom? My father. Lady Margaret sent him to boarding school soon afterwards. She was scared of him. 
And I suppose that's why she was afraid of me too. Well, too bad I can't apologize to her because she tumbled down to the bottom of the mountain. Now that you know the things that happened to him when he was a child. <sighs> you are right. He wasn't the father I needed in life. But in death, he gave everything for a mere chance to protect me. Good Parenting 101. Oh. Look, it's my father, my padre, Odo-san. Love me, Papa. Now let us stop this madness once and for all. And he disappeared into the night. Lead the way, Miss Candlestick. It's even creepier in this mansion now that I know that there's no one else in here except for me and Andrew. You want to go out to dinner after this? My family's dead and it gets kind of lonely in this mansion. <laughs> See you on the other side. Hello from the other side. Oh, I did it. You did it. I just hope we are not too late. See you on the other side. Andrew's mind seems to be crumbling under the mirror's influence. We need to stop him before he drags Edward's corrupted soul back into this world. I still cannot quite believe what is happening in this strangest of places. And you're not even related to any of them. <laughs> Thanksgiving must be a hell of a chore. <laughs> After All right. you. Too kind. Um, no, I insist. Ladies first. <laughs> You got the candle. Whoa, this place looks pretty modern. I wonder if Edward spent a lot of time down here in his secret chamber. David, stop! Don't move! What? Huh? What's wrong? Can't you see? Right by your feet! An abyss! An abyss? What are you talking about? I can't see it? I'll guide you across. Just listen to my voice. One step oh. back, then to your left. Please be careful. Okay, moving forward. Stop. Turn to your right and move forward slowly. Okay. Stop. Turn to your left, then straight, but be careful. All right. Ah! Ooh, that was too close. Leah? She just said go forward, just follow her instructions. Father? Help me with your short shorts, please. Please. Oh. Ah. oh shit! She did not fall into the abyss, did she? <laughs> Just as well I couldn't see it. Where's Leah, though? Definitely looks like there's some rituals going on here. Leah! Oh, damn it, it's not moving! <laughs> you thought pushing on that rock was gonna help you somehow? He pushed on that rock like he thought he was the Incredible Hulk. <laughs> My magical witch powers! I send this boulder a tumble. Ooh, there's a telephone. Hi, Papa John's. I'd like to order a double cheese pizza with pepperoni. Uh, make that too, because I'm not exactly sure how many people will be over for the ritual tonight. So, do you take credit? Right. Your cheap tricks will not stop me. Where the fuck am I? I'm lost. Hello, Mr. Knight. What the? Um, there's just a table. Alright, I'm not gonna mess with that. <gasps> oh, father! You want me to use this, father. But what for? Motherfucker, so you can see! What do you think you use it for? The same symbols as in the village. And the gate. Okay, so... Go through here. And then go through here. Maybe I go back through. And then go this way. Uh... And then go this way. Damn, I must have taken a wrong turn somewhere. Oh, shit. It goes through the doors with the runes on it. Okay. And I'll go through here. And then go back through here. And then... Maybe it's this door? Damn, I must have taken a wrong turn somewhere. Fuck are you! Okay. Go through this one. 
I'm lost. Help me. Okay, go through this door. And then... Go through this door. I got it. Yes! That was a pretty fabulous looking salt shaker I got there. Alright, now for the other side. What the fuck? This is trippy, bro. Should've known when I was hearing them voices, man. Been doing too many of the drugs. And now my life has turned upside down. And when people ask me, how's it hanging? I say slightly to the right. <laughs> I can't reach the statue. But my reflection... Hmm. What about my reflection? The side's looking damn beautiful. <laughs> but that's not what we're- that's not what we're working with right now. Whoa. Oh, now I get it. Every time I come back in here, it turns a little bit. Okay. Sorry, Mr. Knight, I'm just spinning your world around. I must inquire about your predicament. <laughs> get it, inquire because he's a knight? <laughs> okay. I got it. Ow! What the hell? Bro! I thought we were brothers! We're on the same side! Dude, not cool. I hope I'm not too late. We could have been twinsies, bro. We could have had a thing. But no. But, as it turns out, of course, I am the superior brother. <laughs> What the hell? How did he get a hold of you? The mirror. The black mirror. It's a freaking hot tub? Oh, so spooky. <laughs> ah, David. I'm delighted you could join us. I knew you'd find your way here. What's up, bookworm? Let the others go, Andrew. This is a family matter. Amongst us true Gordons. Oh, egging you him are on. So right, Kissing him my off. Dear cousin, this is a family matter. David! David. Oh, hell David. no. If you think your cheap tricks can stop me, you're greatly mistaken. Get a grip, David. Sir David, why did you let me die? Oh hell no! You have disgraced this family. Shut up, bitch! You're in a pit. Go back to your pit. You didn't even say nothing. You're just an asshole. <laughs> You're not seeing the bigger picture, David. This family, this clan, was once powerful enough to drive the Roman legions out of Scotland. We can have that power again! Massacring an entire village of innocents in the process. I want that as much as you, Andrew. But do you really think you can control the thing Edward has become? He's just you taking a nap. A disappointment to me. You are nothing! <laughs> Less than nothing! Get the hell off me. Before I kick out your knees. Hit you in your arthritis. Use the force! Push him in the hot tub! Do it! Dunk him! Don't! <gasps> what the fuck? He just straight murdered him! I'll be needing your blood too, David. We don't need Edward. We don't need Edward. We can find a way to control the mirror. You and I, together. I don't care for your disrespect for my father. For one of the greatest Gordons who has ever lived. What do you need me to do to complete the ritual and bring Edward back? Not much. Just a few drops of your blood. My father, could he be brought back too? Pure Gordon blood flows through my veins. 
Once my father is freed, there will be nothing we cannot do. All right, we're about to have a Pokemon battle. I summon my father. You summon. You summon Edward. We just go at it. <laughs> Give me the knife. I'll do it myself. David, my dearest cousin, you really need to stop treating me like I'm bloody stupid. Very well. Together then. David, don't. Shut your mouth, woman. Pretty sure he got Are sucked into another right? dimension. Yes. Ah! Help me! David! Oh my god. Someone peed in the hot tub. I should have known. It's a mermaid! <laughs> Aww. That's nice, but he's gonna drown. <laughs> you are mine! Mine! I'm pretty sure I'm not going anywhere. <laughs> I swallowed some of the Edward goo. I think we should be leaving. Agreed. Yeah. Would you look at that? I found the deed to the house down there. <laughs> See? It's written in blood. <laughs> uh, if we even make it out of here alive. <gasps> oh no, that part of the castle is coming down again. Ah, uh, now that the Black Mirror is destroyed... Aw, oh, Rory, no! <laughs> Sending him out to sea. That's a nice burial for him. Rory's gone. The Black Mirror's destroyed. Rest in peace, Rory. If such a thing is possible. What? You... you doubt it? All that happened here? I am a scientist. I never thought there was an afterlife or anything after. And now, I know there's not only life after death, but there's evil there. My father, Rory, they saved us. And I must believe they found their peace. It's up to us to find our own. And hope that it lasts. That was beautiful. How are we gonna explain this to the police though? All right, that's at the end of it, guys. We destroyed the Black Mirror, sent my grandfather to the giant anger management class in the sky, and sent Rory on his way. And I inherited a new mansion. <laughs> now I can invite all my friends, and we can have a big house party. It'll be great. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this series of videos. If you did, please leave a like, leave a comment, tell me what your thoughts were on the videos, and I will see you guys in the next video. Goodbye, everybody.